The Proud Peacock Once upon a time, there was a proud peacock named Peter. He loved his beautiful feathers and always boasted about them to the other animals in the forest. One day, Peter was walking through the forest when he saw a group of animals gathered around a pond. He strutted over to them and asked, What's all the fuss about? We're admiring the beautiful pond, said a squirrel. It's so clear and still. That's nothing compared to my feathers, said Peter haughtily. They're the most beautiful things you've ever seen. The other animals rolled their eyes. They were tired of Peter's bragging. Why don't we have a contest to see who has the most beautiful thing, suggested a rabbit. I'm in, said Peter confidently. The other animals agreed, and they all gathered around the pond to watch the contest. The squirrel went first. He stood up on his hind legs and showed off his fluffy tail. Very nice, said the rabbit. But it's no match for my beautiful fur, said the fox. The fox strutted around, showing off his orange fur and white tail. That is beautiful, said the rabbit. But it's still no match for my feathers. Peter stepped forward and spread his wings wide. His feathers shimmered in the sunlight. Wow, exclaimed the other animals. Your feathers are amazing. Of course they are, said Peter smugly. I told you they were the most beautiful things you've ever seen. But just then, a gust of wind blew Peter's feathers all over the place. Peter tried to catch them, but he couldn't. He flapped his wings wildly, but he only made things worse. The other animals laughed. Your feathers are beautiful, said the rabbit. But they're also very messy. Peter was so embarrassed. He ran away into the forest, hiding his feathers under his wings. Peter learned a valuable lesson that day. It's not good to be too proud. It's important to appreciate your own beauty, but it's also important to be humble. Moral of the story. Pride comes before a fall.